Ever since I could remember, I had nowhere to call home. My mom was a drug addict and my dad was in jail. I ended up in foster care until my aunt and uncle took me in when I was four years old. Living in that home, I was sexually and physically abused. Eventually, I found refuge with my grandparents, but that didn't last long. Before I was even a teenager, I was sexually abused by my uncle. By the time I reached high school, my life started to fall apart. I began partying, doing drugs, and having sex. I dropped out of high school multiple times. All my partying led to two DUIs, and shortly after I found out I was pregnant. I was lost, and I didn't know what to do. At this point, a lot of people told me to have an abortion. I just couldn't stop the lifestyle I was in. I looked for help, and I found Mama's house. Looking back, I can say that being here has been an answer to my prayers. When I walked into the Hope Center, Jan and Christina gave me a big embrace. They made me feel that I was loved and that God had a plan for me. She explained the program in detail, which helped me know what to expect. I felt at ease and it was here that I finally found a place that I felt safe where I could find rest. When I got to the house, I was welcomed by the house staff and the residents who also made me feel loved and like I was home. They then showed me to my room, which they had prepared for me. It is something that I never had. Everyone was ready to help me and support me. The staff members worked together by introducing me to Pathway to Success, a fast track that helped me set and meet my goals. The house manager and case coordinator met with me weekly to keep me accountable. They were always there to encourage and push me to do my best. Within the Pathway to Success program, I was able to finish high school. I was also able to attend California Nurses Educational Institute and get my license to become a certified nursing assistant. Twice a week, I was able to meet with licensed therapists which helped me make wiser decisions and learn to cope with everyday struggles. For the first time in my life, I felt like my voice was heard. Being a first-time mom was scary, but that fear was put at ease when I started my parenting classes. The amazing facilitators walked me through parenting stages and reassured me that everything was going to be okay. If it wasn't for my dedicated tutors that came on a weekly basis, I would not have been able to finish high school. They encouraged me to achieve my goals, get my diploma, and continue my education. They never gave up on me. Mama's house not only cared about my success in life, but also my spiritual walk. Growing up, I attended church, but never had a relationship with God. I didn't fully understand until I met my mentor who journeyed with me and taught me more about God's love. Now I just don't know about God, but I have a personal relationship with Him. I have been able to accomplish all this and more at Mama's house because of what they have to offer. Thanks to the amazing volunteers that helped babysit my baby so I can attend classes and therapy. They also took the time to drive me to appointments teach me parenting and new life skills like cooking, caring for a home, and how to be a good mother. Now I feel equipped and ready to raise my baby so she can have a better life and prayerfully never have to experience some of the things that I've had to go through.